So within the Red Dead Online bounty hunting role, there have been bugs for almost two years now that have never ever been fixed. This role isn't free to play either. You buy the game or the standalone for Red Dead Online or whatever. You jump into online and you have to obtain 15 gold bars in order to actually invest in this role. You play through and a lot of the time it's going to bug to the point of you not being awarded gold, XP or cash. And there was a level 20, like maximum level cap to each of the roles in the game. However, at the beginning of December 2020, Rockstar expanded the Bounty Hunter role and they gave everyone a prestigious bounty hunting license. This license will expand from level 20 to level 30. It will have different types of bounties available, I believe a couple of extra legendary ones as well. And there will also be some extra things to unlock. Things like more of the award tokens and then you also have a couple of little bits like bowlers and outfits and stuff like that. However, this prestigious bounty hunter license is also going to cost you 15 gold bars. So your investment into this role to get its maximum potential is 30 gold bars, which might not seem a lot to a lot of people, but it's the fact that it actually costs and there are lots of bugs within the role. The worst one is, I got the role to level 20 and I never actually knew about the expansion until recently when I started playing, preparing myself for the Blood Money update. And that's when I realized there was the extra, like, basically expanded license. And I purchased it and started doing some of those bounties. The way they work is actually different to the other ones. For an example, going to the Emerald Station bounty board will start a bounty where you're looking for three widows. And what it does is actually gives you three separate missions within one sort of mission chain. So you take down each of the widows separately. Also down in Rhodes, there are four brothers that you have to do the same thing for. But me and Pete was doing this and we started up in Emerald Station. So for the day of playing Red Dead Online, we wanted to finish up at Emerald Station. However, we come across a bug within this as well. This expansion that also costs gold. And every single time I tried starting this third Widow Bounty, it never actually initiated. Every single time I tried it, it wouldn't actually work and load the bounty. I play on Xbox, so I was dashboarding, I was finding new sessions. I must have tried six or seven different times. I then switched it over and let Pete try doing it. I joined Pete's posse and let Pete try, and it still didn't work. We must have sat there for maybe an hour, an hour and a half, and then all of a sudden, the one session we joined let us actually start that bounty. So not only did we have to pay gold bars to take on these new bounties and get an expansion on our license for the role, we also come across bugs that wasted a lot of our time, got incredibly frustrating, and just outright shouldn't be in the game at all. Rockstar should be doing way more patches to this game. So that was my little experience, and I want you to let me know in the comments if you've experienced any bugs in the game recently, and also how bad some of them have been, because I imagine the scale is pretty big. But that's going to do it for this one. I will see you in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed it.